Hold on. Arlene. The fish has to get down. Hurry up and get that last one. I got to get it up or the wind will blow it all off. Yes, yes. Come down. Hurry. Be careful. Be careful. All right, guys, I just explained to you a little bit what I did on the inside. Now I'm showing you what's been done out here after that little brief rainstorm where my chitlets almost got blown away on top of the roof. Some people may call that child abuse. I call it hard work. So anyway, we got, uh, we got it coming around here. Got everything wrapped. I did the roof. As you can see, we're putting, uh, I'm putting flashing on the top, all in the corners here, because it's tin. Well, you can't see that one, but that was corner too. You can see where it rained and it started coming up a little bit right there. That means I need to nail that back in. All this is treated on the outside fascia. It's all treated, come around. Okay, we got, If you've been with me from the beginning, you know what this looked like in the beginning. Just a RV. There's the back. I'm gonna put a door right there because that's where my uh, hot water heater, electric box, stuff like that's all gonna be in a little cubby hole back there. And this side here, got the flashing at the top. I'm gonna do this one tomorrow. I'm gonna do that one. Let's come up here. Let's see what it looks like up here. The ladder. This is really good stuff to use. I've used it several times before. So anyway, I just got, that's just to prevent another piece of prevention. Uh, the tin goes over that. I'm gonna have another uh, ridge cap that goes over the tin so we're gonna nail all that down of course it started pouring down rain and so we missed a lot of it that's all gonna get done this part tomorrow I come up here finish it up so that's what we got here on this side I'm not gonna have any windows on the other side I'm gonna have two windows three windows three windows the kitchen window Let's go over there and look at it. I have a deck right here, of course. I'm gonna have a window right 
there and right there and right there kitchen above the sink two windows here my couch is gonna go here big screen TV on the back of them windows people like to make these things uh, all country not me I've been living in the country all my life this thing is gonna be modern completely modern as you can see I'm doing something on that too but I've been working on that so that's the tiny house for now tomorrow we'll be putting this black tin up which will not be fun so see you tomorrow well I'll see you in two seconds all right so we've been putting tin up I got four pieces already right, put up you can see right here I got two pieces on the other side I got two pieces I'm gonna trim it in of course um, I have a corner cap that goes on the gable side right here and this is the tin it's not easy to cut I got socks with my sandals because it's sparks flying all over the place keeps hitting my feet keeps hitting my feet so I'm, I'm, I'm doing it right so right now I'm pre-drilling hose I'm pre-drilling hose so I can uh, so we won't have so much trouble up there when it's time to do that. Uh, two, two and a half inches. It hangs over about an inch. I'm only putting one. I know some people will freak out. Put one. One, which is three in the middle. Three screws in the middle, including one by the seam. I'm putting two, two, two putting one screw here one screw here one screw here because at the top ridge I'm gonna have a screw here here so everything is gonna be screwed at the top once I put the ridge on so I'm just putting one for now and one in the middle because I want I want at least the amount of holes as it is possible in this tin so this, this. Okay, that's our putty for us to uh, sew it and seal. Take it off right now? Yeah, take it off. As you can see, I put the putty on already before we put it on the roof because it's a lot easier that way. We just forgot to do it on that one.
better than it is on the other side. Huh? The edge of the No, it doesn't matter. They usually have a little plastic thing that you can put if you want underneath here. I'm not going to put it only because uh, it's at such a good angle on this side and that side. I don't have to worry about uh, rain getting underneath this. Some people would say they put it because they don't like you know bugs. They worry about bugs. I don't worry about bugs. I mean, bugs are going to get in your house one way or the other anyway. So. I'm not worried about bugs getting in here at all. Once I seal this and this, if I still worry about that, I'll put something in here, here, but too much trouble right now. I got a little, got a little rubber things to go here, gonna go in the pitches. When it's raining, I don't want, I don't want water to go in between the house. Screw the screws. You want to screw them down on the the little rubber part. You want to bear as soon as it starts moving down. You want to stop. You don't want to screw it too much. You don't want to screw it not enough.
You probably could cook an egg on it about right now. I don't know why it's hot. It so, got hot really fast. So it introduce like, yourself. Oh, it's hot now? It's hot. I just it was just in the it shade. Hot. Introduce yourself to the world. You mean to your two thousand? Yeah. Hi, my name's Gavin. Gavin. I'm Uncle uh, Russell's nephew. That's my nephew. Man, and we're putting the roof on. Hot. And it's hot. We tried, tried to wait till late afternoon. You can see the sun's already going down. Can't see it over there. It's going down. But it doesn't matter. It's like 6 o'clock. Is it really? Yeah. It's 6 already? Yeah, and it's supposed to be nice and cool. Really? Man. Does it feel nice and cool? It's not cool. So we're getting the roof on there. Uh, I got that one piece up there. Once I get that on up there, uh, I'm gonna box it in here, or trim it in, and uh, weatherproof it on the corners. It's so hot up here that the tin, on my, like when my sweat drips, it like. It doesn't even roll down. No, it just it starts to. Evaporate. It goes. Chish. <laughs> I got a towel up here. Yeah, we tried to do it when it's cooled right. off, but it just doesn't matter. All right. All right, how's it going? I'm trying to put the plastic thing in, but right. it's so tight on here. So we're putting the ridge cap on right now. I got to do some little work on this side, but I ain't worried about that. We got a hurricane in the Gulf. Well, about to be a hurricane, so I'm trying to get this ridge cap on. There we go. So what he's doing is putting the, the little rubber 
plastic thing or whatever they call it in between the ridge caps so it will seal at the top you want to you don't want a big old hole up there grab one of them ridge caps oh never mind i'm gonna come up i'm coming up okay let's see what it looks like so you can see not editing worthy. Oh crap, that's why. What happened? That'd make a lot of sense. What happened? I have to push that back. Alright, show them that little plastic thing right there. This right here? Yeah, that just goes in between. Just like that. Goes in there. And uh, it seals everything. Where water can't get up there. And walls can't go and make nests. And down here, I didn't put one, which I could if I wanted to. I could go back and put one. It'd be a lot easier to do it from down here than up there. Here, this fell down. And that's the ridge cap. That's how it's going to look. Next thing I show you is the completion of it all. Then we air this bad boy. Don't fall. I'm trying not to. I'm sweating. <laughs> <laughs> like a water hose. I know. You got this. All right, guys. I just wanted to wrap this up. I have everything done here, except for training right now, actually, except for the the cap on that little area right there. Got it done over here. Got the trim. Got a little bit of caulking and trimming to do, but it's raining now, and. They have that tropical storm about to be a hurricane in the Gulf. So it gets to test out my roof for real. So, got the caps. I ran out of the cap. I didn't have enough to do that one there, but uh, I'm going to wrap it up so I can start on something else and do it without filming it. Next project is the siding, windows and siding on the walls. Let's go inside and see if we got any leakage. It's been raining for quite a while. So far, I don't see any leaks or anything in that roof. Got a little opening right there from the my paper, I need to put some some more paper there, but that's okay. That'll be good. Floor's finally dry. Got a mess over here, but got my insulation. Got way more than that, but, but yeah, here we go. This is it, guys. So next project, like I said, will be the two windows there one window there one window there i have to put one here as you can see i've been putting a little blue boxes for like for the electric work uh my i'm gonna have a little bar that comes out here a couch is gonna go right there here bar is gonna come out here so i have a plug to plug in whatever there i'm gonna have kitchen got some noise now but uh that is the gas a stove sink a window here uh we're gonna have a window here and here and that's about it see you next episode guys don't forget to subscribe like it i think all that helps i know subscribing helps i'm trying to grow this channel and uh make this thing to where it's even funner to do so you have to subscribe you have to like so i can finish this tiny house and you can watch it be done i don't have any windows on this side my big screen tv is going to be on the inside of that wall uh, i don't need that i mean i'm a window up here a little lower than that spot right there, probably right here. 
The other side is going to have most of the windows. I'm going to have my stairwell goes here, so I can't have a window here. Bathroom goes here. I guess I could put one right there. I might do that for the bathroom. I could put one there, maybe. But I'm on my TV here, big screen, stairwell. There's a uh, AC unit. There's really no uh, no room for any windows on this side. Anyway, keep watching. Subscribe. Next video is going to be siding. This whole thing's going to be siding. I'm gonna put one p one uh, one by twelve running all the way across right here, and I'm gonna put uh, outside uh, siding that goes from here to here, and then from all the way here down is gonna be white tin. So it's gonna have like a little design to it. And that's it. Subscribe guys, help me out. Like it, comment below, and uh, I'll tell you something back. See you, keep hope alive.